Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to some more Stardew Valley. The weather for for tomorrow. Cloudy and windy. All right. Fortune teller says, spirit is neutral. Today is in our hands. Hello. Dear one, Bad Terran. One week from today, we are holding the Stardew Valley Fair in the town square. It's the biggest event of the year, drawing people from across, from all across the country to our humble town. If you'd like, you can set up a grunge display for the event. Just bring up to nine items the best showcase that best showcase your talents. You'll be judged on the quality and diversity of your display. The fair starts at 9 a.m. Don't miss it. Okay. Grapes. Yay. Pick up some seeds. Did not get a full refund on our seeds there. That's all right. I'll have to do. So seeds. We don't have any more. Summer, spring, and summer. Might go buy another sunflower. Just so we have five sunflower seeds. So what do we want to put on display, I wonder? It's one week. So we've got some time to think about it. There we go. It'll be something. I would like to put the special jelly on display so uh, from the ancient fruits it would be like ancient jelly I guess I'd like to put that on display if, if at all possible I don't know if it is knock that out knock that out there we go oh need you all right We'll just go ahead and go up the line here, see if anyone needs to be watered. You do, and you do, and of course you guys do. I know that. Go up this line. All right, I think we nailed this one. Great. So we'll drop you off for the day. We have sunflower seeds and pale ale. There's some blackberries and grapes end up in here, interestingly enough. What would we want to put on display? I guess some fine crops would be good. Obviously. We'll probably put up some alcohol. Oh, that's an artisan good. So, maybe not. If we're gonna The artisan good we're going to put out will probably end up being... Uh, probably end up being the ancient jelly if we can. So we're going to go buy one sunflower. Or buy, oh, uh, yeah, ancient doll, a new doll. Okay, then I suppose we can drop by the museum. Now we're just going to be in here all day, aren't we? We're going to be in town all day. Birthday on the 11th. Okay. Bok choy for Shane. Sure. Why not? Hey, Pierre. Thank you. Pam. Are you home right now? Or what's the deal? Yep. There you go. Give me that. Ah, that's the stuff. Real nice and hoppy. Notes of citrus and pine, but with a robust body to keep it grounded. Thanks, kid. This means a lot to me. I know I can count on you. If I knew you better, I'd be more inclined to chat. Works for me. Stop by the museum. Hello. 
No more gummies, huh? Life's rough, huh? Hello. Put those two together. Kind of weird. Have fun. Now let's head on back. To the bus stop. Let's go to the mines real quick. Actually, it's actually really convenient. We can just pop out here. Grab some of this. The biggest downside, I would say, to using these mine carts... Actually, we'll go ahead and walk back on the scenic route up here. Uh, is that we actually are not seeing a lot of people. That could dramatically hurt our ability to uh, to give gifts and such. Alright, anything on the way back to Forage? Yeah, Hazelnut. Good. And that's it. Okay. <laughs> Just the one. But you know what? Sometimes that's all, ne all you need, you know? Just the one. Let's put a wall right there. Sunflower seeds before we forget. There we go. Alright, let's get you guys out of here. We need to clear it out. Clear it out. I want to be able to get to my trees. And I want to do it in a timely fashion. So let's get you guys all out of here. You know, we haven't checked the chickens today. So we'll go check the chickens. Here. Have some blackberries, a hazelnut. Soggy newspaper. Hey, chickens. Have some hay. We're going to make some mayo. Bye. Alright. All of you, just shoo. Get out of here. Get it all out of here. Well, clicked out of the screen. Apparently, mouse is not locked to window. Noted. Although, the fact that it took me this long to do it is actually pretty good. Let's clear out some of this. There we go. Get rid of the weeds. Actually, we should probably also go grab our uh, woodcutter's axe. That would be useful. Oh, yay. Cloth. It's also an artisan good, for what it's worth. Wait, snail goes in here, right? There we go. Why'd I come in here? I don't need to be in here. I need this. There. <sighs> I confuse myself sometimes. Alright, that's a little bit of hardwood. Let's get a little bit more hardwood. Great. Let's just clean that up. We don't need you guys growing on the wo on the fence. <laughs> Be a little weird. Let's see. This ought to do. Uh, 
Yes, get rid of all the grass. All the grass. All right, and we got some more wall to build. Be on the outside of the wall, it'll be easier. Alright. That's a hoe. There's the axe. Here we go. And we'll just do that. Also, this stump needs to go away. Okay. Nah. I like it looking like this. We can build a gate, right? Yeah, two gates. Or maybe one gate. There. So we have a gate. And then over here, we want another gate. I guess you need to have wall on both sides to make the gate work. In that case, wall, wall, gate. Close that gate. There. Hopefully that'll work a little bit better for us. We'll need to figure out how we want to organize the rest of this. But for now, this should keep the grass at bay. And it'll look really nice and pretty outside. Actually, you know what? You know what? We can build a lot of different paths. I'd like to build maybe a path going down to the south. This takes a lot of stone is what it looks like. Stone or wood. Either way, we need stone. So let's grab stone, deposit the wood, also deposit the hardwood, the fiber, the sap, and the seeds. Let's start with 60. See if that does us any good. So we can start right here. There we go. In fact, that looks like it's plenty big enough. Come on. Gosh dang it. There we go. There we go. Look at that. Look at that. That looks so much better. Two, one. We need one more. We can make one more. There. Now we have a nice little path we can walk through here. Ah. Good. Good, good, good. Go ahead and leave you in here. Oh, and the, the stone, too. We'll sell half the mail. Well, more than half the mail, ultimately. A little bit of cash today. There's some wood. Or the woodcutter's axe, the scythe. Alright, it's 9 o'clock. Which means everyone's home. We can't bother them. The doors are closed. So what do we want to do with the remaining few hours that we have? Actually, I think I know exactly what we want to do. 
I want to see, I want to test. See if we can plant any of these. Because I don't know what we can plant when. Out of season, out of season, out of season. So what, plant them in the... What, in the, in the winter, I guess? Or maybe we plant them in the summer and we missed our opportunity. I don't know. Whoops, wrong one. Sell half the muscles. We can afford it. Yeah. That's fine. There we go. Well, we can always expand our auto watering farm. It's an option. We have a whole bunch of seeds now. We have 30 fall seeds. So if each one of these handles eight, I guess four more would do it. How about we do two more and we'll let it cycle through. So we need two iron, two quartz, two gold. And I think we'll just use regular fertilizer here. How much fertilizer per? Just one to one? Oh, no, it's it's two sap to five fertilizer. Oh. Uh, then we need... Whoops. Gosh dang it. That's not what I'm trying to do. Whatever. That's another... Five. Is that all of it? 16. I think that's right. Quality sprinklers. Put one here. Put one here. And go hoeing. Till the land. There. Fertilizer. Perfect. And then we'll do the same thing here. Great. So those other seeds that we have will be ready to replace when this is done. So when this finishes its rotation, we'll have another batch of seeds to keep it going. And just like that, our farm grows yet again. Well, let's fill up on some water. Make sure that our watering bucket is ready for tomorrow. And let's go to bed, guys. Remember, if you like the video, give it a like. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And share it with your friends. The best thing to do for the channel. Patreon and Tad are down below if you want to support the channel. If not, that's cool, too. I'll make videos anyways. So thank you guys for watching. I do appreciate it. And I will see you guys next time with some more Stardew Valley. The FTBA.